Question 8. The shaded shape is drawn on a grid of centimetre squares. Part A. Find the perimeter of the shaded shape. Now it's very easy to get perimeter and area confused. I always think of perimeter as being like a fence around the outside of a building, a piece of land. Therefore it helps me to remember that perimeter is the length of the line around the outside of a shape. An easy way to do this is just to check off each line as you count it. So I'm going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So there are 14 lines that make up the outside of the shape. But notice this is a two mark question. You could possibly have thought maybe it's testing that I got perimeter correct. But notice how it tells you that it's a centimetre grid, but there are no units. So your second mark will come from actually writing down that the perimeter is 14 centimetres. Part B. On the grid below, draw a square with the same area as the shaded shape. Area is the space inside the shape then. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 squares inside this shape. So all you need to do is to draw a square with an area of 9 squares. If you can't remember it, I would experiment, but remembering that a square has the same length size as height, so it must be 3 centimetres across and 3 centimetres up. If you do not draw a square, but it still has 9 centimetre area, you will not make the mark because the question is very clear by saying draw a square. It's a one mark question, so be careful.